Let's have a look how it is managed that at the same time when something is produced, it is consumed as well um, on a Europe-wide level. Let's imagine this is Austria with its neighboring countries. And each country has one or more transport system operators who manage all the consumption and the production. So in Austria, for example, this is APG. This is the Austrian power grid. And the Austrian power grid issues balancing groups to, it each, uh, to, it, to its members. And the members, the balancing group responsible parties, they need to take care that for each of this balancing group, the production and the consumption is the same at all times. If the APG, if the transport system operator figures out that there is something off, that somewhere there is more produced, more forecasted to be produced and consumed, for example, then the transport system operator uh, tells the party, which is the producer or the consumer, for example, that there is something off and they need to change that. If they don't do that, when the time of the delivery of the energy comes, then the APG runs some power plant to compensate if there is more consumption or less consumption than there should be. This is the case in all the neighboring countries here as well. So here in Germany, for example, there are four transport system operators. And there is 50 Hertz, Amprion, Tenet, and Transnet BW. In Czech Republic, there is JEPS, which is the transport system operator, and SEPS here for Slovakia. In Hungary, it is Mavia, Eles in Slovenia, Terna in Italy, and Swiss Grid in Switzerland. 